Hello friends, it's me Valerie and I am back with another unboxing. If you're new to my channel, I am a part-time reseller. I do have a full-time job, but I just do this on the side to help supplement my income, bring a little extra money in for my household. Um, I've been doing this since August of last year. So I am slowly creeping up on a year that I've been reselling. I sell on eBay, Poshmark, and Macari, occasionally on Facebook Marketplace, but I don't do really well on there. There's certain things that I may post on there here and there, but I don't do well on there at all. But the other platforms I do pretty good on. Um, so I am doing an unboxing for you guys today. Today I have an electronics um, mystery box from Catch and Deals. I like to buy their electronic mystery box. Um, they usually are really, really, really good. I haven't had a bad one. Um, you know, it's pretty risky because sometimes you don't know what is inside. You don't know what works. Sometimes on occasion, there's like one or two items that I can't test. Like recently I got a what it was, what is it? It's, it's something for a computer. I don't know if it's a CPU, something of that nature that I don't know how to test. I can't test. And then I think I got recently um, uh, outdoor like security camera um, that I wasn't able to test. But for the most part, everything that I get, usually there's going to be some items in here that helps the box pay for itself. Um, and so, as you know, it's hit or miss in this game, in this, in this, in this type of, I guess job or gig or whatever hustle, it's always um, it's always a chance that it can be risky, especially when you buy in mystery boxes. I personally love the mystery boxes because I I really like the excitement and seeing what's inside and like it's almost like it's Christmas all the time. You don't know what you're gonna get. You know you got this box and it's like what's inside, what's inside. So um, it's exciting to me, but again, like I said, it could be risky sometimes because you don't know what you're gonna get. And what's going to work and what's going to sell and what's not going to sell. So here we go. Here's um, the box right here. This is the box. Let's see together what's inside. Uh, the la And I think it just varies. The last two boxes I got were bigger boxes. But I think it just depends on probably what they're putting inside. I think for the most part, everything still equals like for whatever hard it over the top part so you know to a certain amount they know that they're going to put a certain amount in the box um for that could equal up to maybe like you know 200 300 dollars in sales but you know so yeah that's that okay so right off the oh interesting oh interesting let's see let's see so this box um like i said the other two boxes i had were larger boxes i've done those i've had these i purchased three um um electronic mystery boxes sometime last month and um this is the third one this is the last one um so i'm trying to get some stuff going and moving before i purchase any more mystery boxes because sometimes i feel like i'm buying a lot of boxes and i'm not bringing in as much as i'm buying so i got all this inventory but i don't get the you know the money to match it as far as what you know what is selling so we'll see um so right here um, I got one of these in another box. I think it's probably the same kind. This is one of those, um, uh, what do you call them, power banks um, for your phone to help charge your phone. Like if you're outdoors or somewhere and you need a kind of little boost for your phone. This is that. Let me close that. Um, let's see what's next right here. This looks like this was open and taped. So this is, you know, and all of these are um, usually customer returns from Amazon for the most part. Um, I don't know if any of them are from like, Target anything like that for the most part they're Amazon customer returns as far as I can tell so this is a can and this looks like some uh, um, ink cartridge I don't know if it's for a regular print or what but it's a um it says can yeah here you go sorry Canon um ink cartridge 210 XL um and like I said it's been taped so I'm gonna have to look at to see make sure it's not been like use use and that thing taken off Oh, this could have been put that on because I could see the thing right here. And I don't know if the person brought the wrong size or whatever the case may be. So I don't think I would probably sell this online. I'm planning to do a yard sale um, in June, two yard sales in June. So I'll probably save this for a yard sale um, and, you know, see how that goes. So right here um, we have a Nest thermostat. I have one of these now posted that hasn't sold just yet. 
um, they must have put this upside down. And this screw is right here. So um, let's put the screw under. So you see, here's that part. Here's the, the screw that goes with it. I'm going to put that on the bottom so it doesn't. Oh, that probably should go on the other side. Anyway, so here is, oh no, this is right, but they put it in wrong. So here's the, here's the nest. It still has a little film on it. So I'm not sure what happened with this return. Here's the battery. With the other one I had, I just plugged the other battery in to make sure um, that it, um, did I put it in the right way? Sometimes you have to move. Okay, yeah, so I'll move the film to see. So yes, it cuts on. You see it cuts on. So everything is all good in the hood. <laughs> everything is all good. So we'll put this back, put the battery under there, this screw and this thing, and then set this back on top. There you go. Because it wasn't kind of situated the right way. You want to protect that screen so it doesn't crack. Um, what do we have here? This is looks like some a keyboard, um, low profile mechanical keyboard, Phantom, Phantom L. So this is that. Um, looks like it was. Um, I can't tell if it was open or, I mean, this probably was open, and but it's still in a little paper here. So I'll check this out as it gets closer. This may be one of those things that's hard for me to test. I mean, I don't know. Um, I don't have a desktop computer, so I don't know how that'll go. If I can, you know, text this, test this. I don't know if there's a USB that I can maybe hook up to something else, maybe my laptop and see if it works, but I'll figure that out and see. Um, I had one of these before, not recently though. This is a USB 5W power adapter, um, for Apple products. Might as well just get to it and see if it do what it do. We have a pair of AirPod Pros here, AirPod Pros. I've gotten these in a couple of boxes between AirPod Pros and AirPods. Um, most have had both Air pods in them I've gotten one or two that air pods that didn't work but I was able to sell it for just like you know parts and things like that for what somebody may want to do for it with it and the last pair of air pods I got I think one of the tips on the air pod was missing but it did have a set one set of replacement tips inside those are still on um, post that they haven't sold yet which I'm kind of surprised it hasn't sold yet a lot of people watching but they kind of must be one to deal. And usually those I have sold for straight 135, the AirPod Pro. So I'm not really at a situation where I need to offer a deal right now. Um, so here are the AirPods. What do you think? Are they inside? Are they not? Are they inside? Are both inside? Please let them both inside. Both are inside. Okay. Both have the tips. Both. Yeah. So like I said, both are inside. Both have the tips there. Um, so... We'll have to see. I'll test them and see if they work. Um, the cord is still in there. Um, factory sealed. Let's see if all the tips are there. All the tips are inside, which is a good thing. So we just got to pray that it works, that they both work. I've become a little pro, if I do say so myself, on testing these bad boys. I am not an Apple owner. I just have a Samson. And, um, but I have gotten really good at testing them when they don't connect, restarting them or and things like that. So that's been pretty cool. I wanted to see what this is. What is this here? So this is, um, a switch game. It's been returned. It looks a little damaged. I don't, I, and we have a switch here, so I'll be able to actually test to see if it works. So this is Pokemon Leg Legend Ar Arcus. Um, ooh, it's pretty dusty-ish and stuff. I don't even want to. So the game is there. Like I said, I'll have to test this and see if this works. This looked like somebody played with it, had a whole field day with it and decided they didn't want it anymore and beat the game and send it back. <laughs> because God, why does it look like that? Okay. Right here, this says Smart Garage Hub. This is it. This is it. Make 
Um, this is probably going to be a something that I cannot test as well. I don't know what you use this for. Smart Garage Hub. Get alerts and control your garage door from anywhere. Okay. I mean, it looks factory sealed still. Um, it's got the film still on it. There you go. That's how it looks. Some other parts probably down here. Yeah, there's the plug and whatever comes in this one. So, interesting. Like I said, this I'm not going to be able to test this. Well, I probably what I probably can do because I see there's a plug. I can plug it up and make sure that it powers on and things like that. Um, so we shall see how that goes. What do we have here? A webcam. Gotten a lot of these. When I say a lot, it's not that there's a whole bunch, but I think I have like three, two posted. One that's probably in another. Did I post it? Yeah, I don't know. But they haven't sold. This one looks a little bit more factory sealed like than the other ones in its parts and things like that. So, yeah, I have this same exact one actually where it comes with a little tripod and stuff. So, you know, these are things I, I've been posting for just $10. I'm probably going to put a couple of these in my um, yard sale that I do um, and see how it goes there. This is looks like another webcam, um, 4K HD webcam. This is it. It looks a little different. Let's see. What's um, what is this? Nest temperature sensor. Nest temperature sensor. I don't know if this is different than the regular sensor. In another box, I got some sensor, but they, I think those are called contact sensors. I don't know what this is for. Looks like one is missing. Is this one missing? Or oh, wasn't one not supposed to be there? How many come inside of it? Oh, it does say three, so it's supposed to be three in it. So here you go. The three are there. This is probably going to be something I can't test either. Um, sometimes I wonder with some of these things why people return them. I know some people do the switch and bait and uh, whatever you want to call it where they switch it out for you know their broken one at home and return a broken one. But something like this that I'll see, I'm like, you know, did they... Did they get it and realize, oh, this is not what I needed or something and just return it? I guess so. I mean, that's usually what returns are about. Um, yeah, I got one of these in the other um, box that I am planning. Oh, and I, yeah, so here you go. It's the um, one of those like, you know, gaming consoles that's supposed to be similar to like the Nintendo. Um, the other one I had, the box looked a little different, but it still had the 620 loaded games. We have one in our house that we had that I brought you know, when these things first came out and, um, the other one that I got in the box did not come with the, um, oh, these look different. This isn't the other one I had, had, um, the wire that connected to it, but the one that I just got in the other box did not have the power adapter. So this one looks a little different because this one comes with this thing like this. The other one just has these cords that you, um, connect to the TV. So I don't know. So yeah, I may um I'm, I can test this and then I'll probably um just save this for the yard sale um that I'm gonna have. And then there's a big yard sale I do um um at the Myrtle Beach Convention Center. They have it once a year, and I've been doing it for a couple of years now, and I usually do really good. So I'll probably whatever doesn't sell at the yard sale, that's in when is that yard sale in Myrtle Beach? I think that is in September this year. Last year was in October. Okay, so what do we have here? I don't even know how to pronounce this, but it's some um, pro gaming headphones. I don't know if these are anything of good quality or these are just like, you know, generic kind of headphones. So it says it's the black and red ones. These are how they look. These are how they look. What do you have here? Honeywell Homes. Uh, this is... Um, oh, a C wire adapter. I guess if you need it, you know you need it. This is something I can't really test either. Um, but it looks like, yeah, um, we shall see. We shall see. Did I show y'all? I'm sorry. I don't know if I did or didn't. That's it. So this is what I was like. Oh my God. Interesting. So this says solo beats. Three solo beats three, yes. Solo beats three. I mean, this is interesting. 
I wonder if everything's in here. I wonder if it works. I wonder if somebody did a switcheroo. -y. This is this is a look. See the excitement. It's like you're like, ooh, this is sun. This is ooh, ooh, ooh. So it comes in this little cute little case here. Right here, right here. Let's see. Just open some of this. Okay. I'm trying to take a look see and see if it's like you know one of those returns that somebody just returned their old one so here you go they feel really nice the the um the oh yeah oh god and my hands are all on it jeez louise these have definitely been used let's see if you can see some stuff is on it the the ear pieces feel like greasy like so i'm not sure What's the deal with this? Why this is like this? I need, um, so yeah. Um, these are need a good cleaning before I even can test these to put it on my damn ears in the first place. So hopefully they work. I have a pair of beats on there now um, that I didn't get in the mystery box. Um, I got this from a Facebook auction that they were doing um, around Christmas time. And so... I paid, you know, one twenty-five for them. Um, they've been there for a while, um, like I said, since Christmas, and they have not sold yet. And I, I just refuse to go too low on them, you know, because at this point, I mean, at this point, I just kind of want to break even. But I don't know. It's not. Nobody's nobody's biting. Nobody's biting. Let's see what else we got in here. What is this? A box. A box, a mystery box beside them inside of a mystery box. Oh, maybe it says it right here. It says it's um it must be eternal desktop hard drive. You can tell it's new because. I'm pretty sure because it says it still has this thing on here where it says, um, you know, like, you know, if it's broken, they won't return. So it doesn't seem like it was open. But this barcode on here, sometimes every now and again, I can get it to scan on um, Amazon. So I'm not going to open it. Um, and hopefully I can get it to scan and I can see what's inside and I can see what it is because it seems like it's still factory sealed. This is a dash cam. Um, I think I got like three dash cams posted right now. I've had more than that and they've all sold. I don't know if everybody's got their dash cams down. They're not looking for any more or what. So this looks good. Um, was a little bit out of the thing, but you can see that the, the, um, the film is still on the screen and on the little, the lenses and things like that here. I haven't had this brand before. So... And it's got all the, you know, the stuff at the bottom there for the cords and everything. So that's interesting. What is this? I saw this. What is this bad boy? This says Bluetooth, audio streaming, marine gauge, digital, media, AM, FM radio. So I'm guessing this. Oh, this looks like this is for. Oh, duh. I said it right in the name. And I'm thinking it's for like a um car because I've gotten some of these before. But this is actually for. This is actually for a boat. This is interesting. This is for a boat. I wonder if this bad boy will sell. I mean, where I live here in Pauly's Island, a lot of people have um, boats and stuff. So I don't know. We shall see. But yeah. So there you go. We'll see. A couple more items. Three more items. Not counting what I have in my hand right now. Um, okay. So this is an outdoor Wi-Fi spotlight camera. Outdoor camera. I've gotten these. The um outdoor cameras, not necessarily this particular brand. I haven't gotten this brand before. Um, everything looks really good in here, like it's been sealed. It has, so it doesn't have that thing. I don't know if I can test this one. I don't know if it comes with one of those regular plugs or not that I can test. So, but it looks looks factory seal-ish like. Okay. This looks like another one of those cam. I got this particular brand before. Security um, camera outdoor by this company. I've had this one before. Um, let's just see on the top what it looks like. If it was open and taken out. 
And it's a charger. These things are still inside the thing there. Um, yeah, this looks like this is still, this wasn't really used or taken out. The way the cord is wrapped, you can tell that that's how it came wrapped from the, um, from the company or the manufacturer. So that's a good thing. What do we have here? Oh, I have the same one, um, the same exact one, and it came sealed too. Um, generic cheapy AirPods. Um, it's called True Wireless Stereo Earphones. Um, yeah, nothing, nothing significant. And the last but not least, what do we have here? This is and looks like another set of these. Like I says, noise canceling headset for outstanding comfort. Um, is this like gaming headphones? Because it has a little mic there. It has a little mic there, so I'm guessing. Let's see. Let's see if I have. Okay, it's still got this thing on it, so it looks like it's in pretty good condition. The mic's up there. I don't know if you can also use this for like working, like you know, if you work from home and things like that, and you ha do like a um, telephone type job, and you need something like this to um use so that's it that's all she wrote that's all that's inside of this box um some interesting items i think well for sure we know the um the airpods um the google nest thermostat also that um the google nest sensors probably um oh yeah definitely these um these um beats you know hopefully they work maybe that keyboard i'm not sure um and probably this um marine um stereo system i think those are the big ticket items hopefully they are big enough to um get me my money back for this box and then some you know that's always the goal right that's the goal that's the goal that's the goal to make some money 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 <laughs> all right so thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all. If you are new to the channel, like I mentioned earlier, please consider subscribing to the channel. Also hit that notification button so that you can be notified when I post more videos like this in this category or just any video in general. Also, um, please hit that like button. Get, t tell your friends about my channel. Share it on your Facebook. Share it on your Instagram. Just share it, please. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good night.